Ramzan Kadyrov's Akhmat military unit punished deserters of Russian army in Kharkiv. Russian armed forces are regrouping and deploying barrier detachments from among the personnel of Kadyrov's Akhmat in the Kharkiv Oblast. Nazar Voloshin, spokesperson for the Kortitsia Operational and Strategic Group of Troops, said this in a commentary to Liga media outlet. The enemy did not conduct any offensive actions in the Kharkiv Oblast. It is regrouping its troops in support of its actions. The enemy is using the old tactic of deploying barrier detachments from among the personnel of the Akhmat unit, he said. According to Voloshin, in Vovchansk, the main task of the Ukrainian Defense Forces is to hold back the enemy, inflict maximum losses on them and gradually move forward to liberate Ukrainian territories. The situation in the area of Kupiansk is complicated. The Russian army forces are trying to break through the defense of Ukrainian troops from two directions. Ukrainian defense forces have to stop any Russian advance there and force Russian forces to move to the defense, Voloshin added. The Akhmat military unit of Ramzan Kadyrov, the Kremlin-backed authoritarian ruler of the North Caucasus region of Chechnya, signed a contract with Russia's defense ministry on the 12th of June 2023. This was done in the aftermath of the uprising of the leader of the private Wagner military group Yevgeny Prigozhin. The Akhmat unit is regularly used as a barrier detachment unit. Barrier units are placed behind the main troops to prevent the escape of soldiers from the battlefield to catch spies, saboteurs and deserters and to return fugitives and stragglers to the unit. According to the Institute for the Study of War, Kadyrov has consistently deployed Akhmat elements to perceived critical sectors of the front line in order to earn favor from Russian President Vladimir Putin. British intelligence has reported that around 9,000 pro-Russian Chechen troops are deployed in Ukraine, initially suffering heavy losses, but now conducting front line and rear operations. In addition, British intel notes that Chechen forces comprise a relatively small but high-profile component of Russian forces in Ukraine. Kadyrov likely heavily promotes his unit's roles partially to burnish his credentials as a Putin loyalist. An explosion at a chain home improvement store in northeastern Romania on Friday injured at least 15 people, authorities said. Four of the injured are in a critical condition. Authorities are working to determine what caused the explosion. Two of the victims were transported to a hospital in the city of Yash, while two were airlifted to capital Bucharest to receive faster medical care, Ministry of Health reported. Some of the injured people suffered burns of 10 to 15 percent to the upper parts of their bodies, it said. Emergency helicopters were alerted, and two ambulances and two fire trucks were sent to the scene of the incident. A search and rescue mission is underway inside the store. The explosion occurred at about 10.30 a.m., retail company, Didi Man, said in a statement, adding that an authorized external company was working on its Batasani store's gas supply system during the incident. Video footage shared by the authorities showed part of the building's facade had been blown out by the explosion, with air conditioning units strewn across the area in front of the store amid debris.
pompieri cu hidrantul acolo. Cine-i pompier în magazinul ăsta?